Hello everyone uh, and <clears throat> today I will show you how to install uh, Ubuntu uh, Ubuntu CDO and NCL in Windows 10. So first you need to uh, search the Windows features uh, turn on or off. So you need to click here then you will get like Windows features there. So here you see, I check this one, maybe in your computer, <coughs> uh, it is not checked, right? So you need to check here the Windows subsystem for Linux, like you want to install Linux on your Windows 10 computer, right? So you need to uh, click on this Windows, uh, you need to check this Windows subsystem for Linux, then you need to click OK, uh, then, <coughs> yeah, another window will pop up. Okay, so just wait. It's coming. I already did this process before so maybe it's taking time it will change the windows features it's taking time and I need to restart okay uh, I, I did this before so uh, for your case like there will be pop up uh, one windows then it will find the uh, changes files then it will pop up window like uh, uh, in, in it to restart your computer right then you will restart your computer so I'm going to restart my computer then I will download and so after restarting your computer uh, like what I said, like you check the Windows subsystem in Linux, then uh, there will be the pop-up windows, then windows will show you, you need to restart now. So after restarting your computer, then you need to search like here, Microsoft Store. Did you see this? You need to open this one to download uh, Ubuntu uh, in, for your computer. So like open this one. <coughs> When you open this Microsoft Store, you need to search here, right? So you just search uh, Ubuntu. So I will have, I will install the latest version, right? Ubuntu 20, right? Okay. So I I will download this one and install in my computer. So it's saying. I already downloaded this app so for your case like there will be option to download this uh, Ubuntu 20.04 uh, LTS so uh, when you finish in, uh, uh, download this one then you need to install okay so they're uh, asking about this Microsoft so not account create one or next uh -huh. i don't need it so it will be installed so just skip this one uh starting download you see it's downloading so uh, after opening the microsoft store you will just search here ubuntu then there will be option install right then they, they will ask <coughs> you to um, sign in microsoft so maybe you don't don't want to sign in in Microsoft so I just <coughs> uh, then you see it's, it's downloaded and now the products is installed It's downloaded and installed right now I, I need to launch this app in my computer so like installing this may take few minutes so you need to wait in passion 
so after a few minutes it will uh, install right okay this is installing <coughs> Now, what I need to do here is saying enter new Unix username. That means I need to give a username. But please note that you need to remember this username. After the username, they will ask you the password. You need to keep remember this, right? So I'm giving, okay, the username is, okay, it's my, Jalal, this is my name. So then okay i will set my password okay. you need to retype your password please don't forget your password otherwise <coughs> it will uh it will suffer so yeah you see i have finished this one but when you install the ubuntu maybe uh the f in this ubuntu are not updated so first what we want to do i uh, want to do like use sudo this is a command in ubuntu sudo f mm, get update so first this one so don't worry about this uh, command so i, I, I will i will upload uh, upload this command uh, just below my video description on YouTube please if you are please subscribe to my channel if you are new here so uh, don't worry I will give this command so sudo app get update so I want to update then it will ask the password that I just said right so yeah I'm giving my password so for your case you will give the password then it will take time like is now updating my uh, F gate here so it, it will just take few minutes to update but depends on your internet and computer process right maybe your internet is not good so uh, then it will take more, more times so please uh, be patient and finish this process so now you can see uh, the computer has finished the updating right so now we'll type uh, uh, sudo f it install cdo like we want to install cdo so dash enter and it will show you do you want to continue yes we want to continue just type y and press enter then it will also take time to install so please be patient it depends on your computer process and the internet speed okay so now you can see <coughs> the, our uh, cdo has finished the installation right so type cdo then see there is an option like error while loading shared libraries this cannot like there are the library missing so for this one uh, you need to type a command to solve this issue so maybe I have this one so find you or So we have this problem right we have this problem like there is a library missing so if you get this error so you need to type the one one command to solve this issue so even I noted there if you get this error then you need to use this command to solve this issue so you just need to copy this command and you just paste here and press enter then you need to type your password 
Uh, so now you type, okay, let me clear the windows. Type CDO. Now see, there is CDO now. So there is no problem now. So now you can use CDO. So now our task will be to install NCL. So I already, <coughs> I have already written a tutorial for you. So even I will upload, upload this command just below on my video. So right, so you can follow this tutorial beside, uh, uh, like beside these videos, uh, you also I need to follow this uh, tutorial so you don't need to type maybe you will type sometimes you, you if you type uh, wrong spell so then there will be a problem right so be careful about this uh, command line so you need to just copy this command and just paste on terminal and you can solve the issue so for this installation NCL installation. So first we need to download the NCL software. So I, I provided the download thing here. From there you can download <coughs> the NCL. Okay. So like for me, I already downloaded this software. So my software is there in this folder, right? So what we need to do? Yeah, I'm recording. So uh, what I need to do first, uh, you need to make a directory ncl directory right so you don't need to uh, uh, type i'm just copying there from there and i will use here so mm -hmm. so just type make directory so it's a linux command we want to make that use your local then ncl 6.6.2 right type so okay so we need to uh, use like sudo sorry I need to uh, add here sudo so you need to <coughs> add sudo even here you need to type sudo okay so we need to use sudo command so sudo I need to type so just add sudo I make directory it has right it's, it's created there is no problem make directory then you need to copy you need to copy. like are you here right so we need to change directory here and we have this uh, software here so this software you need to copy uh, to this directory then we will unzip so first what we need to do okay I am opening the another Ubuntu uh, okay now change the CD like I will be here uh, my software is there right so I need to come here and I need to show the path in this terminal so I'm using uh, CD this is the change directory command but in Windows like if you use uh, Linux is separately Windows 10 then you just type CD is fine but when you're using uh, Ubuntu in Windows 10, you need to use some uh, uh, command like MNT. It's like you want to mount this path, right? MNT, then uh, where uh, CD, then you can copy this. So where I am now, then I am in F. So type F, right? Then I am in software, this training, then install. Install Lancel CD, right? enter so I am there now now I need to copy this so, uh, I will use this command sudo then cpcp means I want to copy this software and to copy this software to usual local in 6.6.2 so I want to just copy from yeah uh, copy this software from here to there right so just copy this command and type here then you need to give your password finished now so already there so now we need to I need to go there so I have the another right here I already made this uh, directory so I need to uh, CD this so I just copy here so now I am there and so six point six the ls if i'm copied 
copied this Excel software from this directory to this directory. So it's there. Then you just type uh, you know to try okay, just copy this line and paste it here. Then we need to unzip. Directory permission. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, like use. Okay. Like use sudo. Then. You need to use sudo command also there. I the sudo here we need to use the sudo command here and here we also need to use sudo. now you see it has finished right exit uh, okay uh, how's there I don't need to okay CD I, I I want to go back to home now I'm there the home directory so now where I just finish and the I have finished extraction of this day uh, right now I need to set up the NCL environment okay so first we will uh, use the Vim text editor in Linux we, we can use Vim, gedit, nedit right or, or you can use a notepad is okay but uh, we'll uh, keep this command to this uh, directory like dot bash dot rc so we need to type uh, beam bash dot rc just copy and paste okay beam bash rc so it's there so if you want to um, uh, edit so we need to type i i means edit so then come down environment so here I will copy this line okay line and I will paste here it's finished then we need to save our file and exit right so first we will press ESC key then we'll type WQ like I want to write and quit okay and save okay then you need to press enter so I press ESC, then colon, then type WQ. This okay, type this one, then press yeah, press okay. finish. Now we need to type this source, we need to test source bus RC. RC is finished now okay maybe uh, some libraries are not uh, linked with this Ubuntu so uh, before we running NCL we need to like add some libraries so in Ubuntu there is some library so I want to just uh, install these libraries is we'll use this command sudo apt install NCL this one right so type here I want to continue taking time it will take time to install so you need to be patient depend on your internet speed and computer process so okay now we have finished <coughs> the process we have finished processing the NCL and CDO and type NCL you see now we, we have successfully installed NCL is 6.6 now news ncl and cdo this for now thank you for your patience so please subscribe to my channel if you are new here and please share this video 
and this command to your friends and colleagues and help others okay bye